Hello, my Capricorns. This is your X reading for the 17th through the 23rd. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see what kind of relationship you guys had. Let's see. Hmm. I think it was off to a really great start. It was one full of passion. It had, um, I think both of you guys felt like, you know, you guys could go far because it, it had everything that I feel like both of you wanted. Um, it had the passion, it had the stability. Um, I don't see any cups here, but I think that, you know, in the beginning, you know, love is not there. But I think it definitely got off to a great start. Both of you saw the true potential in it here. So let's see how you view the relationship. Hmm. I feel like there were a lot of secrets. There were a lot of things that you guys did not know. I think that um, you had a lot of emotion for this person. Um, yeah. Let's see how they view the relationship. Hmm. They probably didn't come with a lot of emotion. They they probably seemed a little mysterious to you even. Um, maybe Gemini that you're dealing with does not have to be but um, that's an energy that's present they were somebody that was very smart I think you kind of admired them for it I also think you were very attracted to them um, just because of the the mysterious side of it all I feel like this person hit a lot from you they may maybe even came across like you know made you question sometimes you know how they even felt about you here Let's see what your current situation is. Hmm. I think you're just really trying to come to grips with what your own feelings are regarding, um, you know, what has happened between the two of you. I think you're still trying to figure out this person. I think you are trying to forgive yourself for some things, maybe staying in this as long as you did and not really, you know, receiving all the information that, um, you know that you would have wanted to but I think you're just really you know just trying to just come to grips with um, your own feelings right now regarding the situation regarding what you've been through let's see what their current situation is hmm I think that this person is coming to grips with their own reality. Um, I think that they're not comfortable showing emotion. And I think they realize that that was something that was probably an issue for you um, while you guys were in a relationship. And I think that they are, they are, um, you know, trying to basically address that within themselves because I feel like they really do care about you here. Okay. Oh, okay. So let's see huh, how you perceive your ex. They walked away. Yeah, you feel like they walked away from you and left you with all of these, you know, unanswered questions. And you really and truly, I feel like, don't even know really why this person walked away because there again, you, you felt like you guys, your relationship was very strong, like it was going somewhere here. Let's see how they perceive you. Hmm. I think this person. Hmm. They feels like they 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 feels like they feel like they hurt you. But I see them wanting to come back. I see them wanting to address what they actually did to hurt you, and I think they know they hurt you when they walked away here. They feel like you think this relationship is over with, that you do not want to reunite here with these three cuts. That was done is done, and you're not looking back is what I'm getting here. Okay. Look, so let's see of oh, that one to come out. Okay. All right. Feelings about getting back together. You guys want to revisit this situation, but I think you're more concerned at this point as to why they left. Um, you, that's bothering you. That's really bothering you. It's weighing on you. Um, I think that's something that you guys are really looking to address here. Let's see. 
how they feel about reuniting. I don't really think that you guys are like gung ho about reuniting per se. They love you. They love you, but they are quite confused as well. They're quite confused about, um, I think, how to approach you. Because you see their king here, but, hmm. Yeah. The current situation is a page. So they must have really done something that they are not proud of because it's almost like not really that they're cowering, but it's like they're not that confident in how to approach you because they, um, they also feel regretful over the situation, how it happened, because they know that there is an undeniable connection and love between the two of you that you guys share here, okay? It's, it's really, really kind of sad, actually. Let's see what you guys can do to um, bring this back together. I feel like this is you having faith. I feel like this is you giving this another chance. Um, because with the Two of Cups and the Lovers, guys, that's very, very, very strong. Very strong connection between the two of you. Um, and I feel feel it so heavily here. I think it's for you to, you know, give it another chance, at least be able to hear this person out if they come towards you. Listen to what they have to say about how they walked away, if they apologize, if they're sincere. I mean, there's a lot of factors that come into play here when you talk about giving somebody another chance, because of course it's up to you. Um, but if this is something that you guys have, you know, you wanted and, you know, you were in search of, then I feel like um, basically that's all you can do is give them a chance. Give them a chance to put their, you know, their stuff out of the table for you, lay it all out for you, and then you decide, okay? Let's see what it is that they can do. Hmm. I think they just need to leave behind all of the baggage. Um everything that they think they know about this situation just throw it out the window start over again start fresh is what i'm getting here let's see what is the potential outcome here hmm. this is wish fulfillment um and i think you will be happy i think you definitely will be happy um, and I think you will start something brand new away from this person. But when you do that, you know, you bring in this happiness for yourself. So with the Nine of Cups being present, your wishes will be fulfilled because you will. In getting your happiness within you, you will open yourself up, <coughs> excuse me, to receiving that Tenth Cup. And this person... <laughs> I feel will make that leap towards you guys. I really, really do. Okay. The eight to the two of cuts, they're coming back. They're coming back. Okay. All right, guys. So that is what I have for you. And um, you guys be blessed. Speak with you soon.